Okay, so determine the reactions for RA and RB. So, paano natin kukunin yung mga reactions na to? So, number one, step number one, kunin muna natin si RA. And then, dito naman yung RB natin. Para mahanap to, kailangan muna natin gamitin yung summation moment at dito tayo mag-start, mag-moment B. Bakit? Para makuha natin agad si RA. Zero, clockwise is positive. So, it, kung ito yung magiging reference natin, so, ito na ito, 5 meters. So, ilagay natin, lahat daw ng clockwise, ibig sabihin, lahat ng sasabay sa clockwise natin na paikot ay positive. Ito, since sa paikot niya ay pa ganyan, that is negative. So, ilagay natin, 5 multiplied by 5. Next, yung RA mo is sasabay sa clockwise which is positive. So, plus RA multiplied by 7 is equal to 0. So, ang gawin nyo, ito, ilipat nyo na sa kabila para maging positive. So, RA multiplied by 7 is equal to 25 divided by 7 divided by 7. Therefore, your RA is equivalent to 25 all over 7 or roughly that is 3.5715 or 4, sorry, 4. So, pwede nyo na ilagay dito that is 3. Point, or kaya gusto ko kasi whole number niya or kaya naman fraction para wala na masyadong decimal. 27 all over 7. Ngayon, para man naman mahanap si RB, gamitin nyo lang ng summation force sa vertical is equal to 0. Upward is positive. Ano-ano yung mga upward dyan? So, RA minus 5. So, ngayon, RA minus 5 is equal to 0. Ay, sorry, meron pa. Ito. Plus RB. Since RA is given and RB, RB is equivalent to Okay, 5 minus 27 all over 7. So, you have 5 minus the answer natin is 10 all over 7. Kilo Newton. So, ibig sabihin, ito ay 10 kilo, 10 all over 7 kilo Newton. So, that is your reactions para dyan. Next,